God's presence is guaranteed, but his promises are optional. That was a comment that was made in a sermon that I was watching this past week, and that really resonated to me because basically what that's saying is God's presence, he's always with us. He's always there. So no matter what we're doing, God is with us. But his promises, and I see that's a different story, those are optional. You know, and that, that kind of really smacked me in the face in a way and, and stood out probably more so than anything else the, the pastor said during the sermon. Basically what that's saying is if, if we are out of God's will while he is still with us, his promises aren't going to be there because we are not living in his will. And I think about that and I wonder, you know, I've, I've seen people who live a certain way and they know they're not in God's will because they're not abiding by his commandments and they're wondering where's God at. They're not trying to focus on the things that God wants them to focus on. They're not trying to do the things that God's wanting them to do. So they feel like God is absent. God isn't absent. They're just not receiving the promises. They're not receiving the blessings that God's wanting to do. You know, there's people in, there's people in life, they concentrate on the negative all the time. Now, I'm not going to say people aren't dealt tough hands. You know, everybody has some hard things that happen in life. But what I am trying to say is people who concentrate on the negative all the time, who never try to find the positive, who never try to reach out for what God has in store for them. Basically, these people are robbing themselves of the blessing that God wants to give them. They, they are basically saying, you know what, God, I don't want it right now because I'm going to wallow over here and I'm going to do whatever I want to do. You can bless me later. And that's really tough for me because when I think about all of the things that God has in store for his children, it's really overwhelming. We're never promised a smooth ride. We're never promised, promised bright, sunny days for the rest of our lives. We're not promised no tragedies. We are promised that he is with us. And if we live in his will, his blessings will be abundant. The things that we can experience when we are in his will and in his presence, truly unexplainable. There's been times in my life when it's just been dark. And it was after I came to Christ, I knew Christ. And I was really in a situation where other people were looking at Jennifer and I, and they were like, how can y'all be so positive with everything that you're facing? How can you be happy with what the doctors just told you? And I really just have to think about God's promises. We made it a point to concentrate on what God was wanting us to do in that moment. We made it a point to concentrate on how God wanted us to, wanted us to respond in that moment. And through those things, God gave us joy. Regardless of what we were facing, regardless of what may happen in that moment, we found joy. That's really all I'm saying is that statement, as simple as it sounds, it is so huge. God's presence is guaranteed, but his promises are optional. His promises, they're there for the taking, but are we going to receive them? I don't know about you, but I want to do everything I can to try to be in his will so that I can receive the blessings that God wants to give me. Just a little something for y'all to think about today. God bless y'all.